Let's go to Disneyland. We're rope dropping. For your safety, remain seated with the doors closed, keeping your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside while the tram is moving, and supervise your children. Para su seguridad, favor de permanecer sentados con las puertas cerradas, manteniendo sus manos, brazos, pies y piernas adentro mientras el tranvía está en movimiento. Y vigilen a sus niños. Gracias. Please hold on to hats, glasses, or any loose items that could fall from the tram. If an article should fall, please stay seated until the next stop and inform the nearest cast member. Thank you. Welcome to the Disneyland Resort and the Nikki and Friends Transfer. You're enjoying the Disneyland Park in Disney, California. Thank you for helping us enable our guests to enjoy the Disneyland Park for main opening until midnight, 12 o'clock at night. Disney California Adventure Park for main opening until 10 p.m. Hotel and Spa, inspired by the famed arts and crafts movement in California. We are now approaching the main entrance plaza. At the end of your visit, please return here to take the Mickey and Friends and Pixar Pals tram back to the parking area. The trams will continue running until one hour after the latest park closing time. Please remain seated with the doors closed until the tram comes to a full stop. Then, gather your belongings, watch your step, and exit to the driver's left. Thanks for traveling with us today, and we hope you have a happy and memorable visit to the Disneyland Resort. One moment, folks, we're almost there. I work security, so it's just part of my...
7.40 in the morning, a perfect morning. I do say so myself, it's beautiful right now. It's probably mid-70s, just a few clouds in the sky. Nice, mellow mood this morning on Main Street. Excited for a rope truck. We do not have a room reservation at the Disneyland Resort today, so we'll be going on the left side. Good morning. Early entry, hotel guests. Bear to your right. Have your app ready. Have your room reservation on the app ready, not your room key. I haven't decided yet where I want a rope drop. I'm thinking maybe I have not done Indiana Jones in a hot minute. Say good morning to the porch potatoes. Good morning, porch potatoes. Morning. Yeah, I mean, Indiana Jones sounds really good right about now. It has been a minute. But before we get into that queue, we're just gonna take a tour of Rope Drop here this morning. Oh God, I love it. <laughs> there is nothing better, I'm telling you, there's nothing better than a Disneyland Rope Drop. It's just the way to go to Disneyland. Da, 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 da. There's your Tomorrowland. If you have early entry, you go to the plaza inside and you can just zip right on through. Otherwise, you wait with us. Surfs. Morning, guys. Morning. Morning. Tomorrowland. I wonder if Space Mountain will be open. Last time I tried to rope drop, Tomorrowland, Space Mountain was closed when we got there. Now some of these folks aren't going to Space Mountain. Some of these folks are going to Rope Drop Peter Pan. I wonder what the effectiveness is of Rope Dropping Peter Pan on a early entry morning. Because there's already going to be some guests in the queue. These guys are going for the down the middle strategy through the hub. Morning, Walt. Thank you. I would give you my high five, but they're not letting me in yet. But most of the folks are choosing to rope drop either Frontierland, i.e. or aka, I should say, Rise of the Resistance or Indiana Jones over here at Adventureland, and that's going to be our morning. I think what we're going to do is go 
to Indiana Jones in Adventureland and then jump over to Frontierland for Big Thunder. And then, I don't know, wherever the Disneyland races takes us at that point. Indiana Jones, and all I can think about is the bacon that I smell. We watch this guy on YouTube all the time, huh? How are you? the information. Our pleasure. Nobody's going on Jungle Cruise. That's interesting. Yeah. Okay, let's go over here. We haven't seen this place in a while. Hopefully it's running. Because <laughs> this is one of those attractions that is quite likely to be broken down as soon as they open. Good morning. Hey, I know you. Hi guys. Morning. Morning guys. What a great way to start a morning. My goodness. 
Morning. Here are special belts attached into the seats. Simply pull it from the right, inserting it into the left, like so. You see the excellence of this invention? Your buckram journey is fast and then
Show of hands for a spade. How many of you sing the Indiana Jones theme song when you leave? Because <laughs> I do, at least in my head, every single time. Da, 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 da. That was amazing. The scale of this ride is impressive. <laughs> what, what a huge thing they built here. My goodness, Tony Baxter. You got this one, you got Big Thunder, which is where we're headed next, and Splash Mountain. Man, he can make some big attractions. Great job. See how much it backed up? Not at all. Still a walk on. Wow. Lovely morning. Da, 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 da. If you're not rope dropping Disneyland, if you're getting here, don't get here at 10.30, man. Don't get here at 11. <laughs> not if you're planning to get the most out of your day. Rope drop is awesome. We're just getting started. Hey, morning. I'm just looking at that Mark Twain right now, and I'm like, ah, oh, God, that's so tempting. <laughs> but I ride the Mark Twain almost every week, so. Looks great there on the river, though. I know what time it is. Does that clock say 8.20? That's right, 8.25? Still five minutes for Big Thunder. This is a spot, by the way, where you might sometimes find a Disneyland cat. There is a Frontierland cat, but I can't remember his name. Hi. 
our boat. Guess they lost them all in the caves. How unfortunate.
Ah, good time was had by all. I love when people enjoy the rides. <laughs> it makes me so happy. Have you caught that? People were clapping and smiling and having fun. Big thunder. Thank you, Tony Baxter. I'm hungry. I think we're gonna put a pause on our morning. Hi guys, good morning. Go get something to eat maybe at the at the Starbucks. I think Starbucks is in order, although I expect it to be This is the wrong time to be hitting Starbucks, I guess. I don't know. I'm nervous, but I haven't had coffee yet. I mean that looks good right there. Just a cold glass of water. No, I, I gotta have coffee. You know, I would eat breakfast just about anywhere, but <laughs> I'm such a I'm such a I, I'm, I'm spoiled. I only like to drink Starbucks now, and it's probably not even the best coffee, but it's what I like. Uh, I've tried, I've tried the Jolly Holiday coffee and other things around here, but I just can't do it. Just can't. Look at all that Disneyland happening right there. You see that? Astro Orbiter, folks flowing to the castle. Hi, good morning. The hub, Walt, what's up Walt, thank you. So much happening. Ah, uh, and the music transition. And now we're in a whole new vibe and in a whole new world. Turn of the century, Americana. Wonderful. Well, that'd be fun if we could come back to Main Street and maybe grab a vehicle after breakfast. Does that sound good? Omnibus, fire truck. I haven't seen the horse drawn streetcar in quite a while. Hi, good morning. I'm sorry, not the horse drawn streetcar, the horseless carriage. I've not seen the horseless carriage in a while. I've seen the horse drawn streetcar and the omnibus and the fire truck. I feel like I'm going the wrong direction. <laughs> I guess I am. Everybody's coming in, but I'm going back to Starbucks. Okay, cross your fingers, guys. It looks a little busy from the outside. But not as bad as I had thought it might be. My usual go-to here at Starbucks is the uh, ham and Swiss croissant. I'm gonna enjoy this a little bit while uh, listening and chilling to the sounds of Center Street.
song is that? Not enough coffee, not even a venti is enough. I could have two of these. Just what the doctor ordered. Oh look, it's Van. Good morning. Hi, good morning. That's our boat.
Ah, that was delightful. <laughs> delightful. I think now we're gonna head back into Adventureland. We walked by the Jungle Cruise a couple times. Got me Jones in a little bit. I have not been on the Jungle Cruise in a little while. The tiki 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 room. We're gonna put a pin in that one fresh baked. I have not taken you guys in there for a little while either. That sounds just about all right. <laughs> Ooh, Jungle Cruise has backed up a little bit. It's now upstairs. It's uh, 9.45, I think, in the morning right now. So it should still be, you know, not too bad. It shouldn't be a 45 minute wait. It, 20 or 30 is my guess. Oh, there's a queue out the door. Do I need to get in this? children and make sure they stay seated at all times as well. Uh, let's see what else. Um, oh, if you happen to drop anything in the water, just raise your hand. I'll raise mine too and we can wave goodbye to it together. Coming up here on the right hand side is the Temple of the Forbidden Eye, where Dr. Henry Indiana Jones is searching for the world's greatest treasure. I have no idea why he's looking in there though, because I'm standing right here. We're now entering an ancient Cambodian shrine. It kind of reminds me of how my first relationship ended in ruins. On the left is a Bengal tiger. Bengal tigers can jump over 20 feet. Luckily, we're only 15 feet away, so they'll just jump right over us. 
And over here on the left, we have four cobras. Wait, where'd the fourth one go? Oh, that's not good. Anybody see a cobra anywhere? Oh, watch out for Ginger. Ginger snaps. Yeah, she's a real tough cookie. She can be real crummy sometimes. And yes, I know that joke is terrible, but that's the way the cookie crumbles. We are now entering our elephant bathing pool, so get your cameras ready and take as many photos as you like, folks. Don't worry, they all have their trunks on. Coming up here on the right is Bertha. Just like me, Bertha loves to sing in the shower, though I think she's a lot better at it than I am, and my fellow skippers would agree with this. And speaking of showers, if you forgot to take one today, my buddy Squirt up here has got you covered. Hey, Squirt, what do you say? Should we hose him down, buddy? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, I was kidding, Squirt. That was a joke. I was kidding. Watch out, 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 watch out. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Don't worry, folks. You're safe with me. I promise you're completely safe. Well, that looks dangerous. Let's get closer. <laughs> Is this Dr. Chinosuke's camp? It looks like a band of gorillas has taken over to shoot their album cover. Oh no. Okay, which one of you left the lights on? Not if it was you. I knew it. You're never gonna get that engine to turn over now. Does that one have a gun? <laughs> well, this place has thoroughly gone bananas, so let's split. Yeah, I hope you like banana jokes, folks, because uh, I got a whole bunch. Coming up ahead is the world-famous Schweitzer Falls, named after the founder of our jungle navigation company, Dr. Albert Falls. Don't worry, I'll go over it in a minute. Wait, this doesn't look right. Oh, no, I just remembered I was supposed to turn left. Yeah, I was supposed to go through the waterfall and get you all soaked. <laughs> Now I'm lost. I have no idea where we are. Uh, see, we have uh, trees, trees, uh, more trees. Oh, on the left, we have an African bull elephant. An African bull elephant. So we must be in Africa, right? How do we get to Africa? I better ask for directions. Do you know the way out? What was that? Oh, make a left. All right, I'll make a left then. Yeah, I studied archaeology for years, folks. Now I'm driving a boat and talking to animals. <laughs> what have I done with my life? <laughs> oh, looks like we've reached the beautiful and majestic African belt. Let's see, we have uh, zebras, gnus, and the tall ones in the back are Gary, Jerry, and Larry. Larry is a real pain in the neck. His jokes are always way too long. Oh, look at the friendly lions watching over that sleeping zebra. Oh, he looks dead tired. But we'll just let him rest in peace. It's coming up here on the right. Oh, is that Felix? Everyone, we found Skipper Felix. And there's Dr. Moss, Miss Dominguez, Dr. Chinosuke, Miss Murphy, oh, and a rhino. Ooh. You know, I should probably help them out, but I don't really see the point. <laughs> they can't see me, right? Eh, they'll be fine, as long as they keep hanging in there. Now, folks, I'm still lost. I'm not sure which way to... Oh, no. Are those hippos? I hate hippos. They have terrifying, powerful jaws that could crush our boat in half a second. I don't see any other way through. Should we go through the hippos, folks? Oh, fine, fine. We'll be fine as long as they don't wiggle their ears and blow bubbles. Oh, look, they're doing exactly that, okay? I'm going to have to scare them off. Make sure to cover your ears, everyone. Please cover your ears. Oh, congratulations. I just saved your lives. You're welcome. What would you do without me? I don't know either. Was that Felix's boat back there? I wonder where the other half went. Oh, just as I thought, it's been taken over by a group of chimpanzees. <laughs> oh, I hate it when I'm right. Oh, it looks like one of them has a map, though. Hey, do you guys know the way out? Straight ahead? Okay, great. But what was that? How dare you? There's children here. Did Felix teach you that one? Aw, uh, parents, I'm so sorry. This place has thoroughly gone bananas, so let's split. Yeah, I hope you like banana jokes, because I got a whole bunch. Is that Annette up there? Annette, get out of there, Annette! What are you doing in the insect supplies? Oh, gee, I hope the fleas didn't get out. Why am I itchy? Oh, okay, now I know where we are, folks. Yes, this is the one you've all been waiting for. That's right, it's the amazing, the stupendous, the eighth wonder of the world, the backside of water! O2H! O2H! O2! 
now, boys. What's wrong with the engine? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Not here. Please, not here. Anywhere but here. Folks, I have a confession to make. I really hate piranhas. <laughs> and this area is full of them. I'm going to try to fix the engine and get us out of here. If you see any piranhas, just uh, scream. No, 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 no. Hate it, 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 Oh no, let's get out of here! They told me the fish are always fighting in this area! Coming up here on the left is a boa! The boa is a very friendly creature and might get a crush on you! I wouldn't advise getting too close though, the relationship is pretty constricting! Oh god, we made it to the end! You know how I know we've made it to the end? We're at the gift shop where the prices are absolutely rock bottom. I'm gonna let my little friend Ellie finish our tour with a joke. Go ahead, Ellie. I know you've been practicing. Not a great joke, Ellie, but I think you blew it. <laughs> you know what? A lot of people think that's water coming out of there, but uh, it's not. Well, congratulations, folks. You survived the world-famous Jungle Cruise. Give yourselves a round of applause. Clap those hands. Clap those hands. Wonderful. Now keep those hands and arms inside the boat, and please remain seated until I tell you it is safe to exit. You have been an absolutely outstanding group today, but now I'm going to need you all to be outstanding on that dock. And now, folks, I have a spectacular magic trick. I'm going to make you all disappear with these two magic words. Get out. I'm sorry, that was so rude. Please get out. Watch your head. Watch the Jungle Cruise is heaven. Very, very enjoyable skipper today. I love his energy and he, the, the emotion. He was emoting all over his bit. Fantastic. What's going on at the Adventureland Bazaar? Let's see what's new. No. We got some skipper Mickeys. Da -da. Bum, ba, da, 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 heaven. Very nice. Oh, it's. Is this. Uh, yeah, this is main attraction, Mickey. Series 5. He is $34.99. That's fun. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for, the amazing, the colossal, the stupendous, the eighth wonder of the world, the backside of water. <laughs> uh, fantastic. Oh, look how, this is kind of retro right here. This is a very 90s style or, or design shirt. Animal Kingdom. They sure do cross, uh, cross the merchandise a lot lately. Look, these uh, Mickey main attraction ears have little Jungle Cruise hats on them. And our normal foray into the coffee mug world. I, this is both weird and trippy, but also kind of cute. It's a stitch nose and face or smile, but no eyes. It's kind of creepy. Oh, and that is, those are usually 19, I would guess. There's no price on those, but usually coffee mugs are 19. I'm not sure if I've talked about this before. I know I've, I know I've looked at these, but I don't remember if it was in a video or not, but I do love these two shirts, these two Aladdin shirts. Very cool. They're, they're modern, the, the modern uh, live action Aladdin, Jafar and Genie. This looks great. If you're an Aladdin fan, I mean, I love it. They've got a hoodie version of the Jafar shirt as well. And I should mention 28, 28, and the hoodie is 60. They have sold out of every Indiana Jones artifact except for the crystal skull which is 250 and I mean that's a lot and it's from the worst movie of the four but it's still a cool looking artifact I think I think that would look great on your desk or on a bookshelf 
I spy some new Lion King merch. Queen ladies t-shirt that is $36.99. That is very cute. And they've got uh, a set a sweatshirt and a sweatpants set. All right, let's get back into the park, see what's going on. Morning. And Indiana Jones is now almost an hour. It's not even 10 o'clock. It was 9.26. I was wrong about the time before. It was 9.26 when we got into the Jungle Cruise queue. So I'm guessing uh, 15.40. If I were not to look at the clock right now, I would say it is 10 o'clock as we speak. 10.03 to be exact. Love your show. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much, guys. Thanks, you too. I have no idea where I'm going. Hey, good morning, guys. Hi, Rita. Morning. I saw, I just noticed we walked by, I looked at New Orleans Square, Columbia is still in dock. They haven't brought the Columbia out yet. Mark Twain is out, he's probably, or she's probably on the back side of the river. Oh, there she is. She's just coming coming by the uh, Thompson Island uh, the pontoon bridge, it looks like. Very light crowd here in Frontierland. Not like Adventureland where we had the hour-long wait for Indiana Jones. I think I'm making my way back to Adventureland. To, we're just going to go ahead and finish the tour <laughs> and go into the Tiki Room. It's been an Adventureland morning. <laughs> In the tiki 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 room, in the tiki 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 room, in the tiki 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 tiki. Oh my gosh! I'm going the wrong way. Whoa! I'm going the wrong way. I love pineapple. Ohana to yours. We invite you to enjoy this king of fruits and a taste of the islands wherever you call home. Aloha. Maui. They turn the water off at Maui. The mighty one. I tamed the playful sun and gave my people time. Now they set their clocks by mine, for I am tropic standard time. God, this is so retro. Oh, 
Hihime Kyonimana. I am Koro, Midnight Dash. Today my magic feet no move. My head sore, but last night, all oh, Kiki gods have big time. Sham Luau. When drums begin to pound, my head full, big sound. again the, the earth balancer oh when my violent temper rises the earth trembles on its foundation legends say i'm balancing the earth but sad to say i'm just hanging on i think he's supposed to oscillate too isn't he i'm the one who's really sad when I smile, it comes out mad! <laughs> Fire still works, though. Together, wind and rain through tropic lands across the seven seas. Come closer so that you may see what magic there is in fantasy. Can you see that spider web up there? It's enormous. Oh, look at all the people. 
And welcome to Walt Disney's Enchanted Kiki Bar. All the birds in work and the flowers grow. In the kiki, 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 kiki. See the little birdies in great big hand. Me? I know, I know. Move down there, big boat hands. And now see yours and see what he does. Please place your eyes into the center of the room that is. We present the Enchanted Fountain. So many people enjoying their their uh, dough whips. It's making me want to get one. Tropical hide. Look at that dough whip. Dough whip. And by the way, I had noticed in the past that they were saying that you couldn't bring your dough whips into the tiki room, but today you can. Uh, lots of folks enjoying dough whips in our tiki room presentation this morning. So it looks like whatever little brief moment they had where they weren't allowing them they are again Ooh, look at that do you guys hear that and there goes our horseless carriage Ooh, let's catch the oh no we can't they're already leaving I was gonna say we can catch that omnibus oh it's bad again we missed Van. I say, Chum, you know, the wind is changing. Uh, the wind is indeed changing. You know what that means. These guys are very bummers. Cheers, Bert. Good luck, my bummer. Please don't stay away too long. It's a holiday with Mary. I just love this show. I love the Pearly Band. I love Mary. I love Bert. I'm going to go home and watch Mary Poppins. Bye. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, I guess that's pulling us right into Fantasyland, isn't it? see if there's anything new in Merlin's Marvelous Miscellany. Well, they are featuring Peter Pan and Tink. They still don't have any Sword in the Sun merch though that I can see so far. More Tink. More Pita. $19.99 for this tumbler. They do have a whole new Alice in Wonderland section. I am fascinated by this right here. I don't drink a lot of tea, but it makes me want to. It's wonderful. Do you, 
Well, you brew the tea in a different teapot and then you pour it in here and then you serve out of that. Is that correct? Do I have that correct? Because you don't want to put that on the stove. That is adorable. I want to have a tea party. Fresh bake, come to my house, we'll have a tea party. A little cookie, put your cookies on this plate, your little tea cookies. Ooh. More coffee mugs. Things are getting curiouser and curiouser. I'm gonna guess this is 14. That is also 19. Fun tea party mug. Hot liquids magically reveal colors. Look at that. I think I tried this once in a different mug and it didn't work as well as it does in the picture. But still, that's a lot of fun. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. You guys, seriously. You've got to be kidding me. That is, I'm trying to get a look. That's $34.99. That's for a newborn. I don't think they have these in Sophia's size. They all look like they're just newborn size. So I see a 12 month, 18 month. That's as big as it gets, but that's cute as heck. And you're, you're, this is about as generic as it gets for this shop. The, uh, well, I don't know what to call this line, but I think this is an import from Disney World, isn't it? This, they've had these out for a little while here. This sort of Kardashian level. <laughs> That's what I call this, is the Kardashian line. Uh, yeah. Ooh, look at that cool dragon. I want to go home with this thing right here. Actually, I would take all of this home. Just put this all over my office. a toad mug. I don't know how new this is. Oh my god, that's heavy. $24.99. Living in Fantasyland. Fantasyland. $19.99. Oh, it's a, is that a photo album? I think it is. And then you can make a little notes in there too. I, it's hard for me to do both film it and show you, but there's little holders for photos and then you can make, little, that's very old school. Do people still have photos developed like into actual pictures that you can put into a book? Is that still a thing? I feel like that's not even a thing. I feel like we've lost a whole part of ourselves with the digital revolution, everything going digital, that some of the more I don't know, quaint and interesting things that we used to do, we don't do anymore, like photo albums. Actual memories, you know, that you can put in a book. How do we bring that back? Peter Pan is up to its old tricks. That's a 45 minute queue right there. Oh dear. Right now, I just kind of feel like walking around Fantasyland, taking this all in. Toad's doing work. It's gotten busy. Dumbo's back there in that area where I've talked about in previous videos. If you see the queue back there, stay the heck away. <laughs> you know what? Reversing course. I want to go see if the Lion King show is happening. If I can catch it. The timing has to be right. I don't have a lot of time left in the park today. 
But if I happen to time it right, we might stop and see Lion King. But let's go back in that direction. And if we don't, then maybe we should catch the Disneyland Railroad. Tea Party's not doing too bad. We could be in the next round of teacups if we chose right now. Storybook Lane Canal Boats doing work. That's 30 to 40 minutes. By the way, I can very easily just look at the app right now to find out when the next Lion King show is, but monorail. Pay your respects, Fresh Baked. Uh, but I don't want to do that. Because <laughs> I just don't want to do that. I don't like that. I don't want to. I want to go look. I want to go feel the park. I want to feel the vibe of the park and make a decision. I don't want to know exactly when the Lion King show is going to happen. Some of you might. And so there are days maybe when I do, but today I do not. Today, I don't want to do that. Oh, no vaping, you guys. No vaping in the park. It doesn't look like they're getting ready to do a show. I don't even know what time it is. Oh, it, doesn't, it looks like the first show isn't until 12.30. I'll be gone by then, probably. I thought I might go on the Disneyland Railroad, but I've changed my mind, because I, it is now, what is it, Friday? Today's Friday? Golly, is it a Friday already? Uh, I do believe I owe the universe a ride on Finding Nemo, so that's where we're gonna head. We're gonna see if it's not too bad. It's probably, Gotta be 10, 10.45 maybe? It might be too late. Yeah, I think it's too late guys. I can already see the queue from here. Dang it. Dang it. <laughs> He's doing the whale sound. <laughs> <laughs> There's your Matterhorn scaffolding. Hold on a seat. The... Yeah, we're gonna have to find another opportunity for finding Nemo. You know what? Actually, okay. Here's here's what's gonna happen, guys. Tonight, Liz and I and the baby are coming back tonight. Uh, so if that's the case. <laughs> I'll make a special trip over, we'll try to make a special trip over here. Hi, how are you? Uh, and see if we can't catch it on a, at, a, at a low point. And if we do, I'll throw that in here right now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> how did that go? Did it work? I don't know. If we're, uh, you, <laughs> I have no idea. If it didn't, I apologize, but we tried. We tried. Ba, ba, da, da, da. Oh my gosh, that is just such a such a healthy cue. Go get it, Finding Nemo. Autopia looks undoable at the moment. We may have to go back to Fantasyland, you guys, even though that didn't look that great either. Uh, you know, that line for Peter Pan looked very healthy, as did the line for Toads. Maybe we go back to Main Street. Do the Lincoln Theater. Ride another Main Street vehicle. Tomorrowland's not gonna happen. The 
that Tomorrowland loop is going to happen. Hi guys! Space Mountain is 65. Wow, look at Buzz. I hear another band. I hear the Disneyland band this time.
Yeah, of course, sure. Hey, look, it's Bert. For your safety, please remain seated at all times with all hands, arms, feet, and legs aside. Please supervise over children. Your hands mounted up front here is Bert. He is a quick run draft horse. All right. All aboard. I can't remember the last time I've taken the horse drawn streetcar back to the main street. It's been a minute. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm here enough where that would be the case, yeah. Oh look, we enjoyed that earlier. Yay. Time for Bert. I've heard that the Dans may be coming out, so we might stand by and catch the Dapper Dans on a main. Oh my gosh, that is making me so thirsty right now. <laughs> How are you? Good, good. You bet. You too, you too. Bert, you're making me thirsty. Good gravy, that's a bucket of water. <laughs>
Well, thank you so much, folks. We are the Dap Bands. We'll be singing side by side here on Main Street all day long. So we look forward to seeing y'all real soon. And until we do, oh, we'll sing a song. And it won't be very Not much that makes me happier than the Dapper Dance. The Dapper Dance on the main, or the horse-drawn streetcar is about as happy as I can get on Main Street on a beautiful day at Disneyland. I feel like I feel like we can't do better than that. I feel like that's about as good as it gets. And it is 11:20, which is just about my time to go. We might be stopping by somewhere on Town Square. I'm thinking about going to see Lincoln. I'm thinking about getting hit by that <laughs> that omnibus behind me. <laughs> yeah, that omnibus. That's pretty much four wheels of happiness too. Four wheels and two stories. <laughs> Side by side. <laughs> Yep, we're doing it. We're going to the Opera House. We're gonna close with some great moments with Pluto and Mr. Lincoln. Might pay a little few respects to Walt's bench. Not 100% positive that's the actual bench, but we'll pretend that it is. Walt, this is my favorite picture of Walt. The feelings that he must have been feeling, the thoughts as he walks through that the castle, you know, at the end of Fantasyland. I imagine him thinking, I cannot believe I did it. He had a dream to build a full-size train set, a playground for him to play in. And he did it. God, that must have felt great. <sighs>
young Walt Disney. Ready for a performance with school friend Walt Pfeiffer. Since I was a youngster, I've had a great personal admiration for Abraham Lincoln. So when we decided to bring to Disneyland's visitors some great moments in Mr. Lincoln's life, we began an exhaustive research. We wanted to bring to the people today the inspiring words of the man who held this nation together during its moment of greatest crisis, the Civil War. To start with, we were fortunate in being able to secure this life mask of the 16th president. How do we get this blank? This is actually a copy of an original life mask by the sculptor Leonard Volk. Before Lincoln was president. Before Lincoln was president. Before he had a beard. That's right. During our exhaustive research into Lincoln's life, we studied his mannerisms, his gestures, and even his voice characteristics to create a faithful likeness of this honored man. The final result is so lifelike that you might find it hard to believe. Now let's go into the opera house and listen carefully to the words of Mr. Lee, spoken by him a century ago, but which still apply today to free men everywhere. And now, ladies and gentlemen, if you will pass through the doors leading to our theater, we welcome you to Great Moments with Mr. Lee. God. And 
humanity hates injustice and slavery. I see the storm coming. I know his hand is in it. If he has a place, work for me. And I think he has. I believe I'm ready. And with God's help, I shall not fail. Two brothers on their way, two brothers on their way, two brothers on their way, one wore blue and one wore gray. One was gentle, one was kind, one was gentle, one was kind, one came home, one stayed behind, a cannonball don't be no Like a lot of things that you do at Disneyland, when you go to the Main Street Opera House and see great moments with Mr. Lincoln, you get lost in that whole situation in there, and you forget that Disneyland exists outside those walls. Because that was just that was an interesting experience that I had just now walking out of there. <laughs> da, 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 da. And here's Main Street or Town Square, and it's afternoon glory. It's about noon, and I am done for the day. Going to head back out to the Esplanade, take a walk to the trams. We'll be exiting, leaving you with the trams again this afternoon. 
Hope you guys enjoyed the show today. Follow us on Instagram at underscore Fresh Baked, on Twitter at Fresh Baked Disney, that's Fresh with no E, and on TikTok at Fresh Baked Disney. And if you like our show and want to show your support, please do consider joining our Patreon campaign at patreon.com slash Fresh Baked. Otherwise, thanks for watching, everybody. We love you. Be safe out there. Be kind to one another. Fresh Baked. Hey, hi. Have a good day. Thank you. You too. Hi. A lot of people coming into the park right now. Hope you guys have a great, great day at Disneyland. Da -da 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 For your safety, remain seated with the doors closed, keeping your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside while the tram is moving, and supervise your children. Para su seguridad, favor de permanecer secados, con las puertas cerradas, manteniendo sus manos, brazos, pies, y piernas adentro, mientras el tranvía está en movimiento. Y vigilen a sus niños. Gracias. Please hold on to hats, glasses, or any loose items that could fall from the tram. If an article should fall, please stay yeah, seated until the next stop and inform the nearest cast member. Thank you. Alrighty, friends, just a yeah. friendly reminder to all my friends on board. If you did park in Chippendale's parking lot, please use the crosswalk. The crosswalk is the only way back to that parking lot. And if you did forget where that is, it's going to be right under the escalators of Mickey and Fred. Thank you. Driver, you are clear. Just show today's parking ticket to re-enter the parking area. You can enjoy magic all year round by upgrading your ticket via the official Disneyland app before the end of the day. As you travel through our resort, we'd like to remind you that our guest parking areas have a speed limit of 14 miles per hour. 
We ask that you please observe this speed limit and yield the right of way to Disneyland vehicles, whether you're walking or driving. Ready, friends, lower your head and watch your step. Next time, DCA.